Okay, here's Walking Dead Season 3, Episode 10, titled Home. This is everybody figuring out what to do with their past demons in order to move on episode. So you have Daryl, which is an interesting character because you're learning more about him when he's with his brother, and about Daryl like realizing that he needs these he needs his family again. He needs that heart, he needs that emotion, and he really can't stay with his brother because he's not his brother anymore. Daryl has actually evolved, and that's what we learned in this episode. And basically Daryl has kind of like come to terms with who he is and in many ways with the character that doesn't say anything, which is kind of his episode in many ways. And then of course you have Glenn who can't move on because of what happened to Maggie and not being man enough to, to deal with her and of course Rick is in his own little crazy world where he's seeing Shane and Laurie again and like and of course you think that the governor is basically has this this moral like uh, compass mode where he actually figures out who he is but of course no it turns on and like all I gotta say is that him him going after the camp with their little assault rifle doesn't seem like it was planned that well it seemed like more of an assault than an actual planned way which you figured the governor would plan this kind of assault on people but it was a little bit of a, of a third act twist where you didn't see it coming or maybe most of us did see it coming and it was just a fun little episode so you're wondering what's going to happen now with this little factions between the two groups and of course the group that left uh, led by the guy from uh, season three of The Wire whatever his name is great actor and basically and you wonder what was going to happen with this game because Rick turned his back on him. Kind of a cool, kind of cool little series. I know the ratings are gigantic, and I can see why. It's got it's got something for everybody. It's got the got the books subtext for the for the intellectuals, but it's also got the vampire killings for the for the common folks. Sorry for being insulting. That's my review.